tips. Premiere. In this Premiere Pro quick tip, I want to show you how you can go about looping the playback in your Premiere timeline. So the first thing that we need to do is we need to tell Premiere which section of the timeline to loop. So here in this particular uh, sequence, I have, I've done some sound effects editing and I want to do some more sound effects editing. I want to do some mixing as well too. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to find the particular section that I want to loop and I'm going to hit the out, uh, the in point, which is the I key. And then I'm going to find a point where um, right there is fine. I'm going to hit the O key to set the out point. Now we're still not done. We still need to go over here to the control panel all the way over here to this plus icon and we need to open up the button editor and then we need to find the loop playback button and we're going to drag that into our control panel right here and I'm going to click OK and it's uh, in this particular instance it was enabled but it might show up in your uh, uh, control panel as disabled so go ahead and enable it and once you do that as soon as I hit play it's going to jump to the end point And it's going to loop this particular section. So now I can go and I can do some further editing. I'm going to move some things around at the timeline. I can adjust any sliders that I want to adjust. And it's all going to happen as this loops back and forth. So one gotcha that you may run into while you're in loop playback is if for whatever reason you decide that you want to change the out point uh, or the uh, in point of the section that you're looping, uh, Premiere is not going to recognize it until you hit the stop button and then you enable it again. And once you do that, it will recognize the new in and out point that you've set. Hey, if you got value out of this video, I would very much appreciate it if you give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel if you have not already. And if you have any questions or if there's something specific that you'd love to learn about Premiere, leave it in the comments below and I will either respond to the comment or I will respond with a video. Thanks again for watching. Bye for now.